Continuing with our COVID-19 coverage, as coronavirus cases continue to rise in Mississippi. Mississippi covers almost 47,000 square miles and has close to 3 million people. Mississippi became one of the latest states declared a major disaster area by President Trump amid the coronavirus outbreak. My name is Gavin Smith and I'm a freelance videographer and this is my documentary on COVID-19. So currently I'm heading to work. I work full time as a CAD drafter and I do my video work on the side as of right now. But the company that I work for is considered an essential company so luckily I'm able to go to work and still make an income. But I do have a good bit of friends and family that are out of a job and I can see the stress that it's having on their lives and it's really upsetting to see. Now the company I work for, there are about 2,000 employees that work there. So with that big of a number, it does leave you a little on edge because you know you just never know who could get the virus or how fast it can spread throughout the departments. And it's, it, it makes things a little stressful for you. Um, things have definitely changed a lot more since when the pandemic first started. When it first started, I would say everyone was kind of going a little bit crazy, buying up everything in the store. And I'm a pretty light shopper to begin with. I like to just be a little bit conservative and want to buy, save a little money. But once everybody was buying everything up in the store, I didn't know if maybe I should start doing the same. Outdoor activities are allowed, which is good um, since all the gyms are closed. It just allows me and forces me to go out more, to jog, run, work out, and just really be able to just take in nature and enjoy it. You step outside and everything just feels and looks normal. It's not like a zombie apocalypse. But you know, my dad, he works at a hospital and he sees the effects that it's having on people. He's told me it's not something you want to catch. It is a crazy time and it's scary with everything that's going on. But we're going to get through this. Things will get better. <laughs>